So it's time for some urban exploration and today we are going to be diving into a neckbeard nest. You have been warned. Every night browse 4chan on phone. Drain flies attacked it to light so they bounce off phone. Get fed up one night and sob into pillow while drain flies bounce off my head. Dining room table is completely covered in old dishware and by and mummified food. Plastic milk container rots and explodes. The smell was the most unpleasant thing I've ever experienced. As I'm out walking my dog one day I keep him outside a neighbor awkwardly asks why are my windows so dirty. And why I still have Christmas stickers up from like 4 years ago. I I just forgot haha. Get sick once and puke all over toilet. Fall asleep and it's sticky and shit when I wake up so leave it. It's still there and I hover on the toilet now. Fridge won't shut so it gets filled with bugs and rotten shit. Shove it into a corner and use mini fridge for a month. Eventually take a discarded fridge from neighbor's curb while it's night. Old fridge is still there. The only time I talk to people is when my neighbors say hello while I'm walking my dog every now and then. I have no real friends and no family and I am going to be found a rotten husk in my computer chair surrounded by filth when a government worker comes to see why I have and picked up my neat buck check. For a month yet. Anyone want pictures? Get sick once and puck all over toilet. I gagged a little to be honest. Lived like this all my life pretty much used to it. Every once in a while I'll boil some water and scrub myself. It's not ruined it's got an eco-friendly pattern of preserving the structure. Mold and fungus are basically the structural backbone of the house it lives and breathes and on a hot day outside the temperature is 12 degrees cooler outside in the air 80% more mosset. It is its own ecosystem of some very niche organisms that have all come together to form a wonderful symbiosis that started a sealed system of ecology. It's quite amazing really. The whole thing is one giant organism I am betting that the organisms living here have a defense mechanism to any new intruding life form so it achieves a self-reliance. Together with its own immunity I am willing to bet that by adding a source of food you can grow a self-sustained ecosystem that would serve as a repopulation nucleus in the case of a full doomsday. Scenario such as an all-out nuclear war or asteroid impact. You are doing your part to ensure some form of survival for life. Kill me. This fucking thread. Open the sour cream. Open it. Open sour cream. The sourest of them all. Open it. Open it. Open it. Please open sour cream. Sour. Please open and pour on your face. Please just post the inside of it. Reveal the cream. I can't take the suspense anymore. Just show it already. The suspense is killing me. No what are you doing? What the fuck are you trying to do? What are you doing you madman? Near fusion imminent. You wouldn't. <coughs> abort I repeat abort. I'm scared right now. Please OP think of the children. Is it on fire or expanding did the sem get worse can you describe the smell as specifically as you can? The microwave shows a reflection of what was once a man OP is merely a shadow of humanity. Just drink it. Fridge bro please. Enough. Are you okay fridge bro? This is worse than any horror movie could ever dream of being. OP is kill. OP your sacrifice will not be in vain. <coughs> Neckbeard nests truly do disgust me so let's go and point and laugh at some other ones.
Also be sure to check out the links for merch. Got some nice looking t-shirt designs you guys will love. This... this is, is not okay. This needs to stop now. This is cancer. This... this is so much cancer that I can feel the tumors growing on my back. And it's way down heavy on me and it's not okay. Can you help a nigga out and just stop this, please?